What's up guys, Tea Party Percy here and welcome back to the third weekly news. Sorry that it's a little bit delayed, I should have done it yesterday already, but there were some other real life matters and I was kind of busy yesterday, so sorry again, but now let's focus on the weekly news. Today we will talk about the balance patch and about the English patch updates and at the end I have some amazing news for you guys, so brace yourself. So first let's talk about the balance patch from two days ago. As always I will mention the important updates but if you want to know the details I will link a website in the video description where you will be able to find in the future everything about updates, balance and guide. So what changed with the last update? A lot of skills from all the classes got buffed, especially skills which weren't used that often before the patch. This is an interesting approach, they didn't nerf any of those classes but instead they buffed the classes of the lower tier to even out the gap. Do you guys prefer this method of balancing or do you prefer the good old nerf the OP class approach? I personally prefer the good old way, I'm not sure about this, you know, what I mentioned earlier what they are doing at the moment, so what do you think guys? In addition to the class balance, they also made obtaining island hearts on certain islands easier, again, and added finally ranked PvP with season rewards. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna try out a lot of ranked PvP now. If you watch my stream, you know I did a lot of PvP, especially because I wanted to collect tokens for the tier 2 PvP gear, which boosted my island level pretty well. So I'm gonna keep doing a little bit more PvP, especially because the rank season awards are amazing. If you manage to be one of the top tier PvP guys, you will get at the end of the season a sick looking mount. Now you can also use higher level combat potion more often in the limited contents like Guardian Raids. And you can exchange platinum coins for green or blue healing combat potions. That is a really good update or change. I didn't know what to do with my platinum coins. I guess if you guys manage to craft the tier 2 life skill gear after you craft it for the first time, you won't need those platinum coins anymore. So that's a really good thing to exchange it for the combat potions. And the ratio is not even bad. So for two platinum coins, you're gonna get one green combat potion, and for four platinum po coins, you're gonna get one blue combat potion. Before I reveal the surprise, let's talk about the English patch updates first. The second donation milestone update are completed now, which means the skill description of Battlemaster and Infighter are fully translated, and same goes for emote quest items and activities. Battle items and their description are also fully translated, which is amazing. Their next goal is to translate Destroyer, Blaster, Bard and General Tripod skills for all classes. Currently, the English patch team already translated 40% of the entire game, which is amazing. And this just one month after OBT start. And a few days after the English patch update, the team, the English patch team of course, mentioned that they are working on finalizing a website for non-English patch users. So a lot of guys are afraid of getting banned. I can understand that using English patch is always a risk, but especially for you guys, they were working or they mentioned that they are working on a website. And that website is the final topic of today's video. Perfect transition, Percy. Keep it up. Thanks, thanks, thanks. The website is called lolstar.com. I don't really like this name. You know, if you are a veteran Lost Ark Discord member, you know I didn't like the name since someone invented that name. But it's still a really good website though, even if I don't like the name. And this website is made by Sivo. You should know him, he made already a few guides for the community like the Island Heart Guide, the first 15 Island Hearts which are easy to obtain, he made a guide about it. And he is also working together with the English patch team to make a database for English users. As mentioned again, this will be especially helpful for those guys who don't want to use the English patch. As you can see in the background, the front page, there are many more stuff which are gonna get implemented soon and we have also a forum which is already available for everyone. You can check there the latest patch notes and finally there is a place to post class builds and guides. And you can also discuss about those stuff in that forum. God, I missed it. I mean, we always had a Discord we have different discords, but a forum is still better to organize guides and discussions. 
I also have some interesting news for you guys if you want to be helpful and help those guys out to make that forum and the website great. So they are looking at the moment for guys with certain skills for the community website. They are searching for JavaScript developers who can make tools, translators and people to post up to date news. Anyone willing to create guides, tutorial information about Lost R and also anyone who is interested in moderating the forum. So if you're one of those guys who can help us out with the stuff which I just mentioned, then just join the Tea Party Community Discord which is linked below in the description and DM Sivo or one of the Lost Ark mods and we will give you further instructions. Everyone else who can't help or don't want to help, it's okay, you can just register on the forum and join the discussion or make some guides for yourself or ask some questions. And even better, you can make suggestions if you want to see some specific things on the website. So that's it for today guys and what do you think about all these topics which we talked about just now? Do you like the balance changes and what do you think about the English patch? Are you happy? Are you satisfied? And what about the website? I think you're gonna like it. Or maybe if you have any concerns just share it in the comment or join our Tea Party Discord and talk with us. As always guys, thanks for watching, thanks for your help and see you guys in the next weekly video. Bye bye, your tea party Percy.